Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Josh. Welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today I'm here with some more Minecraft survival, and today we're going to be working on our enchantment room. And I've actually tried recording this already two or three times in the past, so hopefully we can get it down this time. But I already started getting some items made, but pretty much we're going to need 15 sticky pistons, or one redstone repeater, four redstone comparators, and then from that we'll need some blocks of wood and whatnot. But I have ran into a problem though, I cannot actually find our... Or I cannot actually find more of the slime balls to make the next four pieces. So, I'm very utterly frustrated with that, and we're still working on it, and I'm still gonna go for and find that, but I guess here what we should do is definitely just start this mining process and digging this area out. So basically this works in a way that lets us change the spawn, the, or what level enchantments we can get at a time, which is very cool. It's actually a design made by Zizuma, or um, Zizuma Void, I think. I think that's how you say his name, I'm trying my best. But um, I really like the design, so I definitely wanted to try it out on here. So, Let's see, the design needs something like that. And bring this back more. I believe it was a one, two, it was three. That yeah, was for sure three, with two on each side. So maybe, yeah, we should go like this. And we'll get rid of that one. And then it goes like that. So I'm gonna just exactly figure out which the design goes and I'll be right back guys. Alright guys, so I have it built out right here, shaped the way we need it to. Looks kind of weird since it's not outdoors, but um, the shape is normal and whatnot. You'll see how it works in just a minute. But let's head back over here. We're actually going to, ooh, we have a crafting table. We're going to have to make 15 stairs. So that's one, two, three, alright that's 16, plus I believe it's six slabs, if I'm not incorrect. Eight slabs, so it's, we'll need two sets of those. Plus, we'll need to just go like that. Sorry, like that. There we go. And now we have enough materials so far. So let's head down here. We're going to have to go get our sticky piston, pistons, our sticky pistons. Uh, it's a bummer that I actually don't have enough sticky or, um, whatever you want to call it to finish it but oh well we'll we'll have to get those soon but basically these guys go right here um, around the edges as they should so I believe if I'm doing this all correct they go right here here whoops ow alright we can clean this up here there we go. Nice. So uh, I believe they go there, 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 there. Oh, wait, no, they go in all the corners. Alright, so that's where the extra one, two, three, four come in. And then we have to go grab ourselves our bookshelves. So I believe that, yeah, we have a bookshelves over at the other house. Let's take Mr. Horsey here. And eat this. One thing I noticed, guys, is that's all of our chickens that were in there despawned, which is a bummer. How you doing, Mr. Horsey? And yeah, that's a bummer, and I guess it's it doesn't like us enough to add them back. Something else that this new snapshot does is you take damage here when you're in a tree in leaves, even with a horse, which is quite annoying and very, very, I've died two times from that, and that's the only times I think I've died in this world, was from suffocating within leaves. Makes sense. There we go. Let's head over here. You're a good stallion. I need an axe. Just hit R to fly, like I'm in FTB. Logic, right? Yes, I know. 
Don't hate. Don't hate on me. There's an axe. Horse, I said stay still. I don't think staying still constitutes you wandering around. Nice, this is so much faster now. Alright. Nice, so let's head back. There you are, horsey. I never said you could leave us. You're staying on our side for the rest of our lives. Ow. Cool. So let's head up here. We're going to have to remake these guys all... Whoa. Mr. Horsikins, you stay in... No. Horsey, you stay there. Now you can't get out. I'm speechless. That's... Our stable's pointless now. They weren't getting out earlier. No. Now come. I think he was just glitching in the wall there and riding his way out. That was weird. It's like, uh, Mr. Horse, you're not leaving our stable. You're still there, right? Okay, because that would be a bummer to have to install some sort of holding mechanism. But if we have to, we have to. Anyway, let's grab this wood that we have here. Um, yeah, I have a bunch of birch wood, so that should be fine for what we need to do. So we'll go turn that into this. Then I believe you actually place the books there. And then these guys surround like that. Alright, that's 11. So we're going to need more than that. 17 more should be fine. Let's see. This, not bookshelves, the books go there. Then that goes there like that. 18. Nice. Nice. So, now we actually have these 18. The struggle is we need to get more sticky pistons. It's so frustrating. I, I honestly want to get these things in here, but it's just so annoying that I can't. I cry every day because of it. But, um, yeah, guys, I guess I'm going to go on the hunt for slime, and I'll be back. All right, guys, so... I actually took a huge cut there, two days cut, I recorded another episode, you guys probably saw that last time. I built a slime farm, and when we finished that episode, it wasn't actually working. But today, I spent hours just digging out another three down, and look at this. We have slimes. Oh yeah! You have no idea how rage-inducing this has been. Oh my god, those slime balls are freaking fantastic! I've literally spent hours on this thing trying to get it to work. I am so happy and also at the same time so sick of dying or digging. But we should have a ton of slime balls now that we actually have a working farm. Yes, 25 slime balls. Nice. You guys have no idea how much of a relief that just was to me. Nice. Anyway, in between last recording and this one, there was a new snapshot update. This new snapshot actually adds iron doors, or iron trap doors into the game, and a few other things, I believe. I think it fixed some stuff, but definitely a lot of bug fixes. But anyway, we now have this going, and it is awesome. So let's head back to our house, and now we can actually finish up our one-click enchanting room that we've been working on, that I've wanted for so long now. So let's do this. Alright. Whoa. Also, do I have some eggs? Yeah. So, we also have to start filling this guy up back with eggs because they seem to have despawned and hate me. That's alright. We can do that in a second. And, um... Alright. Let's head up here. Back into here. Let's clear our inventory with this plethora of stone that we have now. It is truly a plethora of stone. I've also must have gone through like 20 or 30 pickaxes. 
and not actually that much, not that many, but I must have gone through a lot of pickaxes because it was, I used pretty much a, almost a stack on this. All right, just sorted my inventory here. Boom, boom. Let's go, glowstone goes in here. That goes in there, we'll place that at, okay. You go back here, you go over in here, keep you, nice, all right. So let's go, let's grab these four extra pistons that we needed. We'll fill them up like that, sticky pistons. Now, where are my bookshelves? I do believe I had enough bookshelves, because I started placing them, but it's where did I put them? Because one goes here, there, there, and, whoa, not there. Did you, did you see that? Look at this. Wait. Um, I don't think that color is supposed to be like that. I'm so confused. More glitches. Alright, definitely gonna have to report some of these things because I've actually gotten a bunch of them now with these mining and then sleeping. I also have that glitch. I'll take, report that too. But, let's see. I thought I had more bookshelves. Where did thou go? Oh no. No. Oh wait, I think I placed them in one of these chests. There they are. Yeah, I knew I'd place them in one of these chests. Plus, let's grab some stone brick. Ah, uh, and here's these slabs too. Oh, and here's the enchantment table, nice, okay. So, let's go here, we'll place the rest of these bookshelves. And now, we could get started with some wiring. So basically the wiring is kind of complex and I'm going to have to take some time on it. So, let's see. I'm going to grab this there and that, and let's get started with this. So first thing we're going to be needing are these comparators, and let's see, we're going to place one here, we're going to place one here, we're going to place one there, place one here, place one here, place one here, then we fill the rest up with redstone, so we'll go all the way around with this redstone. And let's go. Let's see. Nice. Just like that. And then what's next? So next we need to do is start building up, I believe. So let's grab these stone bricks that we are going to use it for. Let's see, we place one here. One there. One there. And then we get rid of this middle one. And then there's something trying to do so we place that oh and then we come over this way and then we fill the, all the edges with it too so go like this all the way around stone brick okay and then once we get back around I believe there's something else we have to do Let's see it is um what is it? Nope, just, uh, yeah, just like that, I believe. Okay, so now we start placing all of our stairs on all the edges here, so let's do that. Uh, just to make all these things, like all the corners too, so it goes like that. And then we'll go like that, nice. I love these new staring, stair placement mechanics. Makes stair placement so much easier. I remember the old stairs were so annoying. I remember before we can even rotate stairs. Oh god, that was bad. <laughs> Let's get rid of that block up there. Cool. There, whoops, wrong direction. So some things are still a little bit glitchy, but you know. Stair rotate and is gone a far way from where Minecraft has begun. Damn it! <laughs> Why? Of course, when I start talking about it, like, yo, Josh, I hate you. <laughs> and then um, in here, I believe we're going to be placing a half slab right there. Yep. And then, let's see. My eye itches as we're doing this. Not a good time for itchy eye. <laughs> and then we're just going to place half slabs all around here. Except for... I believe this here, I think it's this one that we have that goes like that. And then 
A half slab goes right there. Nope. Wait, no. It goes like that. There isn't one right there. And then there's a block on top and the button goes right there. Okay. So we have to get a way of getting up there. So let's see. Then this goes up here like that. Like that. And then we get rid of this one. Just like that. And then we can close this off right here. And then there's another design for the, um, that we have to make. But I actually do think, yeah, this needs to come out here too. Now, if you guys haven't noticed, I'm kind of following a small little tutorials on doing this that I've viewing, just trying to get this and make it look right and come out correct. So let's remove one more up just in case we need that room. Let's do this. Nice. Ah, uh, mining. The epitome of every Minecraft player who's trying to build inside of a mountain. Going through thousands of pickaxes. Every day. <laughs> I wonder if I could check my stats. Like, I wonder if it logs stats when you go through updates and whatnot. Uh, yeah, through, like, everything. We'll do that in just a second. So I want to see how many blocks I've actually mined. It's kind of fun to see that. Alright. Almost there. That's going to be outside. Yeah. It's okay. We got some cobble. Let's clean this up. Nice. And back here. Just like that. Yay! Now we should have enough room for the rest of this. So, what we do from here now is, I believe, this. Let's see. Let's get that stuff. Pick that up. So, what we do from here is, so. So, we move it back. And then. Then you go up to the side. I think like that. This black placement is kind of confusing. So it goes back. I'm just watching something. Middle, up, front, back, middle's out. Okay. So. Okay. So this goes here. Front, back, mine, middle, out. And then on the other side, you go one, two, three. Okay. Then on this side, it goes like this. One, two. Um, but we get rid of this block right here, and I believe that's all the block placement that we have to do, if I am correct. Yay! Okay, it's time to start wiring things up. So the one comparator that we need goes right there. Or how many comparators do we have left? We have eight left, okay. Well, anyway, one goes right here in this block facing this way, and then the next one goes up here. See. What? Let me over. Next one goes right here. And the next one goes the opposite way right there. Next one. Oh, that one's turned on in subtract mode. Next one goes on the side over here facing this way. And then we have one facing here. We have one facing back here, right here. Then one on this side. And then one on, whoa, not cool. <laughs> Let me back up. Um, this one, so that's right there. Okay, so then there's one right here going that way. Nice. And then the one repeater that we needed, that goes up here. That goes right here, actually. And then redstone placement. Oops. Let's see, redstone placement is just one in the back, right? Yep. Then one over here, right there. And let's see. Hmm. 
This is just like, oh my god, rapid speed placement. <laughs> okay, so that one goes right here. And one goes right here. And one goes over on this side. Over. Whoa, let me up, brah. One goes right there. And then the rest go all the way around here. And then I believe there's one that goes right there too. Cool. All right, so next thing we do is let's head into here. Let's actually clean this up a little bit. Let's place some cobblestone down here to make things look nice. Place that right there. Then I think I want to go grab some stone brick. And we also need to make some buttons. Oh, buttons are made from stone. I forgot that. Okay. So, not stone brick anyway. Low stone. So yeah, we don't have enough. So we'll place for this for now, but ultimately change that. Um, let's see. Do I have any stone made? Because I need buttons. Any smooth stone? Nope. How much coal do you have? You have enough. I'll throw you in there. And next, let's see. Yep, yeah, we just need to place buttons all around, and it should be good. Now, let's see. Let's head back here while we're waiting for that to smelt. And let's just take a look at it, and also let's light the area up, because there's no need for it to be dark now. Yeah, I don't want mobs spawning up here or anything. So, let's see. Nice. And we'll place one right there. One right there. And then what we can do is actually make this little facade like looking area. Just to fool the view here. And that's why I dug one more back. So let's get rid of this here too. there and then I believe we can actually cover all these up if I'm not mistaken but we'll wait for that oops I broke redstone but this here goes like that nice okay so let's go grab our levers and all right uh, not our levers our buttons just to make sure things work button buttons 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 lots and lots of buttons baby I like the amount of buttons in the sky. I want to be buttons. <laughs> ah, let's do this. One button goes right there, I believe. One, two, three. Everywhere there's not a... All right, we need more buttons. More buttons, baby. Lots and lots of more buttons. I need more buttons in the sky. I'll stop singing. Yeah. <laughs> how many, how much more do we have in there? All right, we'll smell just a little bit more, just in case. You never know when you're gonna need more. It's nice to see that I have a bunch of iron left because I need to go mining again soon as well. Let's see. I need more than five. I wish I could have like hyper speed for an eye. Furnaces, fern eye, I like calling them fern eye. I don't know why, but they're fern eye. Haha, <laughs> rhymes all day. Makes people go cray. Let's see, one doesn't go there, but one goes here, 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 and here. And I believe, is there one that goes? Yeah, this one that also goes right here. So, let's see if this works. All right, let's go. Oh, then, oh, we need one more button. We need our reset button. Reset button. Here we come. Coming for you. So you can't be a chew. 
This room just makes me feel like singing all day. Reset. Alright, let's see now if I place this right here, will it still work? Yes, how about there? So if I go like this, I can go like that. Nice. Alright, that's fantastic that that still works. And then we'll place that. Nice. I'll place a torch right there just for now. Because I don't really want to be seeing this redstone. So, if I can get rid of that, then everything good happens in this world, right? Yeah, let's see. There's some more stone. Could have just taken that stone earlier. Boy, I hate when that happens. Boom. Awkward tacos. Up here to the left. We can place this here. And place this there, 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 there. And just for comparison, let's see if everything works. Okay, let's go. Nice, how about that? So let's test each one individually. Nice. And back down. Nice. Look at our little enchantment room right here, guys. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. I like it. So, you guys can see the reason I did this enchantment room was for this. We have 15 levels right now, right? Let's see what we can do with, um, what kind of, I mean, I have all, we're going to need a new helmet soon, so we'll make a new helmet. I don't have enough diamonds. I only have three. You know what? We'll make another diamond pickaxe. Okay, because this one's about to break, and this one, we'll make a nice one here. So, let's see. Oh, I need Lapis too. forgot about the new enchantment, so we'll grab that. Head up here, and you guys can see, while they're all down, what can we enchant with? Well, the max enchantment we can do is a three, right? Well, let's pop one up. Alright, let's see what the max enchantment we can do now. Still a three. Well, what happens if we pop three up? Look at that, still a three. Oh, yeah. not good for example. There we go, that should do more. There we go, four, goes there. So depending on what level enchantment, it'll let us adjust it. So let's go like that. Let's see, let's try to make this with a max enchantment. Okay, that's 15, or 16 I mean. Yeah, let's drop, let's drop that, then we'll go to there. It max is 14 there. Um, let's look if we go there. Max is 20. You can see as we go, it's like fortune 2, blah, blah, blah. Nice. Um, let's go full out and max 24 for us right now, but it should be 30 once we can actually get there. Well, let's see, efficiency 2, question mark. Let's drop... These are changing as we do different books too, which is nice. So you can see, ooh, efficiency two. I, I'll deal with an efficiency two. Let's do that, um, one, two. Okay. What do we get? Efficiency two pickaxe, nice. And you guys can see, just hit up here, reset, boom. So ultimately my plan is place glowstone in these four corners, and that should be good. So. I really like this, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like what we did here. Let me know what you think about this room. And make sure you check out the tutorial video in the description if you guys want an example on how to make this. Or just follow how I did it, but the tutorial is a little bit less choppy and whatnot. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. But wait, I want to just, I want to see if my farm still works. <laughs> Let's go look. <gasps> Because apparently, I just got a tweet while recording this. Somebody tweeted me saying that you can't actually have an in or a room that spawn or you can't mobs won't spawn a glowstone. So I don't know if that's true or not. I heard that glowstone's fine, but jack o' lanterns might be better. So we'll go down here. Maybe we'll switch all the glowstone we have down here to jack o' lanterns at some point. But who knows? Let's see if there are any slimes though.
All right, there aren't any right now, but I wonder if we wait here for like 30 seconds or so, if there will be. Because we weren't in the chunk, we were too far away for them to want to spawn, so that's the reasoning why they wouldn't. But they should spawn in that far chunk, if I am correct. Oh god, bad example again, guys. I feel bad now. <laughs> Oi, this is awkward. What if we go over here? So maybe we'll change these all to it, but I know that it works. I I swear. I swear to you guys, it works. Please don't. Please don't totter me. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'll see you guys all later. Bye.